Hello. I can't hear you. Oh, there. Okay. Hi there, Dorothy. Hello. Yes. Good evening. How are you? I feel very great today. Oh, very great today. Why? Because after this class, we will go mm -hmm. go to go to the camping. Oh, I see. Go camping. Where will you go camping? Um, I will go camping at Nasosa. Mm -hmm. I see. All right. Oh, you are in a different room. Where is that? Ah, here is my study room. Ah, wow. Study room. Yes. I see. Can you show me more? Uh, okay. Can you show me your study room? Um, here is uh, the drawer and uh, the here is a bookcase. Wow. I see. Okay. Wow, that's beautiful. Yes. I see. So it's your study room, only your study room. Uh no, we um oh. I share with my younger sister. Ah, you share with your younger sister. Yes. I see. Okay. So, um what will you do uh this uh, what will you do? Uh, what did you do today? Uh, uh today is started a vacation, so oh. um, we have no uh, we almost not have studies, so we watch it uh, larva and we play the game. Oh, uh, you watched larva? Yes. Oh, why do you like larva? Because they're so cute and also um that 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 animation or uh, um that animation is funny. Mhm. Mm I see that animation is funny. Yes. Oh. I see. All right. Okay. So, who do you like more? The red, the yellow, the pink? Um, I like both, but I like um, um, pink. Why? Because uh, um, that uh, pink is pretty. Oh, pretty. Okay. Oh. I see. Okay. So that is why you like her. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. What about the snail? Um, what is the snail? Uh, hold on. Let me show you his picture. Where is that? Oh, there we go. Okay, wait a minute, please. Mm. This guy. Oh. <laughs> oh. He's like funny. Yes, he is funny. Yeah, wow. and uh, who else? Um, this one is funny too. Hold on. Uh, okay, hold on. The I think this is the beetle, the dong beetle. Oh. No. Mm. Okay, hold on. Oh, it's not. Where is that? 
Uh, let's see if ah there okay. I haven't watched Larva, so I don't know most of the new characters. Uh, where is that? Where is that? Oh, hold on, please. Ah, there. There. Wow. So I only know him, 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 this, this, and this, and this. I actually don't know them. Oh, I know the uh, these. Oh, you know the chameleon. Yes. Oh, I see. Okay. All right. So it's good. Yes. All right. Is it still funny? Yes. And uh, um, there is more character named uh um um. Uh, there is a man uh the human. Human. Yes. Uh, okay. Hmm. Yeah. But I know them. This they are all funny. Yes. Okay. Alright. So have you eaten your dinner already? No, I haven't eaten my dinner yet because um we will eat dinner at the camping uh, camping site. Campsite. Yeah. I see. All right. Is it far? Uh, no. It is um from car is about uh twenty minutes. Uh, twenty minutes. Yes. Ah, I see. Okay. Uh, so it's just near. Yes. All right. Are you going to go on a uh, on camping with your uh, grandparents? No, my grandparents uh, no. can't come in my house. Uh huh. So uh, uh um uh and there is uh the tent is small when we have uh when we um slept all family. I see. So you will only sleep in one tent. Yes. I see. Then I guess you should buy uh, another tent uh -huh. so that next time your grandparents will come oh, or that's, can come. That's a good idea. Yes, it's a great idea. Yes, and then our grandpa will tell stories. And oh. grandma will sing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right. So how many days or how many nights are you going to stay there? Um, we will um back to our home at uh um Sunday. Sunday. Yes. Ah. Okay, and then. And then we will sleep. Two days. I sleep two days. Yes. I see. Okay, and then. Um, and then when we uh, uh when we go campsite, uh, we my mom and dad, my parents are already make a tent when we go to our school. I see. How long is your vacation? Um, um, our vacation is finished at about August twenty. August twenty. Oh, it's almost one month. Yes, but my wow um, winter vacation is uh winter vacation Longer. is no uh the two oh. weeks only two weeks. Two weeks. Yes. Oh, I see. Okay. All right. But it's good that you can. Uh, yeah. So your summer vacation is until August 20. 
Yes. Oh. Wow, that's great. Oh, who's that playing? Is that uh, your sister? Yes, maybe. <laughs> I see. Okay. All right, so let's proceed to lesson. Hold on. What lesson are we now? Lesson three. Uh -huh. The invisible line. Okay. Now, can you please read it? The Earth is divided into four hem um, hemispheres, which are the north, north, northern, um, southern, eastern, and western hemispheres. Hemisphere means half of the Earth. The equator divided. Uh, uh, the the earth into the northern and southern hemispheres. Um, mm -hmm. The northern northern hemisphere includes North America and northern northern part of our uh, uh, South America, Europe, some of Africa, and most of Asia. While the southern hemisphere includes the rest of South, South America and Africa, Australia, um, Antarctica, and uh, Antarctica, Antarctica, and some Asian islands. Some Asian islands. Okay. All right. The climate of the northern hemisphere um, is a, uh, the climate of the northern hemisphere is different from the southern hemisphere because of the of the movement of the earth towards and far and away uh, uh, and away from the sun the hemisphere mm -hmm. that is um tilts towards the sun ex experiences the warm conditions of summer. The hemisphere that is teal tiled away from the sun experience the cold cause um conditions of winter. The part of the earth surrounding the equator is called the tropics. The tropics have mostly warm weather because it gets more exposure to the sun. Unlike in other parts of the earth, the tropics only have two seasons, which are the wet and dry seasons. seasons. The, the amount of rain each tr trophic gets is different from one another. It also affects the spices of plants and animals that live there. For example, African tropics have baobab trees which store wind weather. Uh, water is uh, water in it huge chalk because of the dry climate. While the island of Sri Lanka in the Sri Lanka in the Indian Ocean is home to twenty two hundred fifty um, uh, uh, spices of frogs because of the wet climate. 
Uh-huh. Okay. By the way, this is pronounced as species. Species. Yes. Okay, read it please. The prime meridian divides the the earth into the eastern into the eastern and western hem hemispheres. The eastern hemisphere refers to the area of of the earth which is east of the prime meridian. This area includes much of Europe. Africa, Asia, and uh, Asia, Australia, and some island of um, Okania. Because of its huge area, a big pollution can be found here than in the Western Hemisphere. The Western Hemisphere refers to the area of the of the Earth, which is which is west of the the prime meridian this uh, this area includes north and south america western promotion for Portion. uh, portions of europe europe. Asia, europe asia and africa um the tip of um, tip Siberia. Uh, Siberia, most areas in Okania, Oceania, 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 and a portion portion of um, Antarctica. Tica. Yes. Okay. In what hemisphere is your country located? Um, our country country located eastern hemisphere. Eastern? Why is eastern? Uh, oh. uh. Our country is here. Ah, uh, I see. Okay. Yeah, because this is also all uh, my country. Oh. Yes. Okay. Right. We are both in the Eastern Hemisphere. Okay, name the globe line A. Um, it is Northern Hemisphere. Uh, hemisphere, hemisphere. Okay. All right. Name the globe line D. It is the southern hemisphere. Southern hemisphere. Okay. Arrow A is pointing at which hemisphere? The northern or the southern? Is a north. pointing where? North. Yes. Okay. It's pointing north because it's pointing there. Okay. Arrow B is pointing at which hemisphere? The northern or the southern? Um. The uh, southern. Mm hmm. Very good. Arrow C is pointing at which hemisphere, the eastern or the western? Um, the western. Western. And arrow D is pointing at which hemisphere? The, uh, the eastern. Eastern. Okay. Okay, this tells me about what you remember. 
Now, study the globe below and then identify whether the following are in the eastern or in the western hemisphere. Okay. So, North America, is it eastern or western? Uh, North America is... Um, Northern? Northern? No, it's just Eastern or Western. Oh, uh, the Western. Western, good. How about South America? Uh, Western. Western. How about Africa? Uh, west, uh, Eastern. Eastern. How about Asia? Asia in the Eastern. Eastern. Okay. All right. And then? Uh, how about Australia? Australia is in the uh, uh, Eastern. Eastern. Okay. Very good. Oh, hold on, please. All right. Uh, let's go to the next page. Mm, we've got that. Okay. Now, what is the importance of knowing the hemisphere where your country is located? Because when we don't know where is our hemisphere, then we can't find our country. Yes, okay. All right, because uh, it would be easy to find if we, if we know which hemisphere does it belong or uh, where or what. Uh, yeah, so, all right. So, or... It is important to know the hemisphere where our country is located. So we won't be having a hard time uh, looking at the globe or the map, the world map, if in case we would look at it. Okay. Now answer the following questions. When the Earth is divided in half horizontally, the top half is called uh, the hemis uh, the um, uh, the north ha northern hemisphere. Okay, when the uh, horizontally. Hold on. Uh, Ah, okay. Good, good. Oh, how about the bottom half? Um, it is south has a hemisphere. All right. When the Earth is divided in half vertically, the left is called... Is called the west, uh, the east hemisphere. Uh huh. And then the right is the west hemisphere. Uh, I think it's the left is the west, and the oh, oh no, yeah, the left is the west, and the right is the east. Yes. Okay. So I think our time is up. Let's continue our class again on Monday. Yeah, so Dorothy, I've sent the MP3 already and I've sent another homework on your feedback, okay? Okay. Okay, happy weekend and happy camping, Dorothy. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.